For this study, we're looking at Rodriguez, Hate Street Dialogue. This is the same guy that brought us Sugar Man. Nice rhythm section, especially for ukulele as well. Sounds like this. Now what's quite cool about this is a little rhythmic tap on the 2 and the 4. You can hear it and see it there. Watch my thumb. Okay, but before we get into the rhythm, let's look at the chords. So we're going to focus more into your fretting hand, and we're going to see our opening chord is a D minor. Now please make sure you get a copy of the PDF as well. It shows the chords quite clearly. Finger 1 is on the second string of the first fret. Fingers 2 and 3 go to the second fret, fourth and third strings. There we go. This is D minor. Now the cool thing is when we change from D minor to F, all we do is that. Simply remove the third finger. G, I'm sure we're familiar with that. Fingers 1 and 2 in the second fret. String 3, string 1. Ring finger to string number 2, third fret. And then B flat, for those that have been playing Yuki for a bit, might be a new chord. First finger flat on the first two strings over there, like that. Second finger goes to the second fret, third string. Ring finger straight to the top. Here's your B flat. Should sound like this. And the cool thing is when we change from there to A, all you need to do is simply slide back, which means your first finger slides off the Yuki, and fingers 2 and 3 are here for the A chord. When we go back to D minor, we small transition back to something like this. Okay. Now onto the rhythm side, we're going to focus on the rhythm quickly. Now I'm going to place a D minor chord, just one more time, that chord there. And we're going to look at the rhythm. Okay, we're starting with the down strum, one and two. On the count of two, I tap my thumb across the fretboard. And notice that I'm tapping across where the fret is itself, not across the hole and not behind the hole because listen to the difference in the sound. Behind doesn't do much, but over here, it gives a nice sort of percussive sort of rhythmic sound to it. Here's D minor with it, one and two. And that means your first finger is at the bottom end, which is cool for the upstroke. One and two and three, because obviously all your and strokes are upstrokes. And four to round it off with. So it's one and two and three and four. Or you can break it down as down, tap, up, up, tap. Simple like that. And in context, you're going to have... Also find books quite nicely is adding on an extra strum after the fourth beat so you can do this if you like to so if you like that extra strum there like that down tap up, up tap up you can do that as well now very important over here on the structure of the song it's one bar of D minor which I'm going to take you through first of all a bit of a zoom out because I need us to see both left and right hands your fretting and your strumming hand and I want you to see it's one bar D minor, one bar of F, one bar of G, and here comes the fun part, B flat, one strum, and as I tap, my hand moved down. What's that movement again? Down, tap. So it moves as one, because that means my fretting hand is in position for my upstroke on the A. Down, tap, A. So in context, if you play along with me the whole way through, slow motion first, one, two, three, four, and... And a little bit faster, one, two, three, four, and... Is that and for the chorus this is going to be one of the most basic simplest but yet powerful choruses that I've ever heard so far it's D minor and nothing but D minor so for the whole way through the chorus you're just strumming D minor you keep going I 
think it's eight times. I never really counted it because I rely on the words. So very important. Listen to the song. Get to know the song so that you can hear when they're ending and they're coming back into the, the basic chord progression again. So get to listen to the song. In essence, now we've covered everything you need for Head Street Dialogue for ukulele. It's a really fun jam. I hope you have lots of fun with it. And uh, have a great week. Chat soon. Take care.